Good morning. This is Madhav, professor in EC department. Today I am going to give a small demo on how multiplexer and demultiplexer will work. Okay. I will start with a simple concept of multiplexer, how it is working. Multiplexer is one of the versatile device through which you can select whatever input at the output. That means a multiplexer consisting of so many inputs, it consisting of suppose for example take four inputs, these four inputs will be projected at output depending on one particular thing that is the selection line. That means if you take a multiplexer, so multiplexer accepts so many inputs but produce only one output. What is that output? That output is nothing but any one of the input you are connecting to multiplexer. Okay. So initially, I will start the multiplexer operation with a small example. All of you know the television communication. So generally what we will do, suppose something will be recorded in the studio that will be transmitted through antennas and uh, once a cable operator wants to get that signal, he will put some antenna in his office on the top of, top of his office that antenna will collect all the signals. So, so for example, uh, you take some uh, channels like uh, uh, Star Sports, ESPN, uh, NGC, like that. So, you are having so many channels. All those channels will be captured through those antennas and th that particular signals will be given to multiplexer. This multiplexer, what it will do is, it will take all the inputs and depending on the selection, here selection is frequency. Depending on the frequency, it will separate NGC channel, it will separate star sports, it will separate ESPN like that. So that means cable operator will use a device of multiplexer to which you will give so many inputs and output you will take depending on the selection. So what he will do? He will collect all the information, produces some output, depends on the selection. After that, he will, to our home, we will get only single cable. Once we got that cable, that cable carrying all the information, all the channels, okay? Once it is connected to our TV, in our TV, what we will do is, we will convert all the, we will take all those channels again, we will separate all those channels again with some selection. Simply what we will do, we will take a remote and we will press one, we will get one channel. How we are getting that? By pressing a particular channel, you are tuning to that particular frequency. When whatever channel that you want to see, whatever tuning you are doing, if these two things are matched, then you are getting that particular channel in the television. So this particular example will give one particular information that is first we will take so many inputs and we will convert we will transfer those inputs and we will take those inputs through single output line and here based on a selection of frequency and after that a single input will be taken and we will split that input or that information we will transmit to different outputs so if you take a concept of multiplexer so multiplexer what it will do is, it will accept so many inputs, it will take so many inputs and produces single output. So the multiplexing operation will be like this, taking multiple inputs producing single output. How many inputs that you are taking, depending on that, these selection lines we will select. Suppose if you take four input lines. 4 you will get because of 2 power 2. So that power value is nothing but your selection line. That means if I take 4 inputs, I have to take 2 selection lines. So inputs if I take A, B, C, D and if I take output Y, this multiplexer I will call as 4 is to 1 multiplexer. This multiplexer will work in this way. It will accept 4 inputs and any one of this input will go to the output depending on the selection, depending on the selection. Here I have taken 4 is to 1 multiplexer. So this will work in this way. 
if two selection lines whatever selection lines that we are taking if these two selection lines if i kept it 0 0 my output value is nothing but first value of the input that means if selection lines if i made 0 0 a value will go to the output a value will go to the output if i take selection lines 0 1 i will get b value if I take 1 0 as selection line, my output is C. If my selection line is 1 1, my output is D. So A, B, C, D are 4 inputs. Any one of the input will go to the output depending on the selection. By putting different values to these selection lines, I will get these inputs at the output. So this is the block diagram of 4 is to 1 multiplexer and this is the table further okay so now i will show the logic diagram of 4 is to 1 multiplexer whatever operation that i discussed now this operation i will convert into logic diagram so for that what i require i require four inputs a b c d four inputs i require two selection lines s1 and s0 and every time selection line values are changing so that's why i will take a not gate also because it will produce the complement value of the selection line so i have taken four inputs a b c d and two selection lines these two selection lines are taken with not gates also to take different combinations so as per our earlier discussion this 4 is to 1 multiplexer is working like this if selection lines are 0 0 my output is nothing but a so what i will do if both the selection lines are 0 0 output 1 you will get from not gate lines so i will take a connection from s1 bar s0 bar and i will take connection from a these three I will connect to one AND gate. So when this AND gate output will become one, when selection line S0 is zero, S1 is zero, and whatever A value that you are choosing, if this value is one, then final this AND gate will produce output one. Okay. Suppose you want to produce output B, your input B value you want to produce at the output. For this, take connection from B and now selection lines are 0 1 so what you will do you will take s0 and s1 bar these things i will connect to another and gate like that next time i will take selection line 1 0 so i will take connection from s1 s0 bar and i will take another connection from c in the last case i will take s1 s0 and take connection from so now four AND gates are taken each AND gate is connected to a particular input first AND gate is connected to a second AND gate is connected to b third AND gate connected to c fourth AND gate connected to d and every time selection lines are changing in the first for the first AND gate selection lines are 0 0 next 0 1 1 0 1 1 four operations so now as per the block diagram multiplexer output is single output but here we are getting four outputs from and gate so all these outputs i will connect to an or gate so this is my final output y so in this way i will construct the multiplexer logic diagram so now i will apply any i will take some values and i will show that how this multiplexer is working suppose if i kept a value 1 and b value 0 and c value 1 and d value 0 i am fixing the inputs and now i will change the selection lines just look at here initially i am keeping selection lines 0 0 if i am keeping selection lines 0 0 just look at the first and gate output so this is connected s1 is 0 so s1 bar is 1 s0 is 0 so s0 bar is 1 so you will get 1 here, 1 here and A is already 1. So 1 into 1 into 1, output is 1, output is 1. If you see the remaining AND gate outputs, 
this AND gate selection line is connected to S0, so this value becomes 0. Once any one of the input of the AND gate is 0, automatically output is 0. So that means you are not getting anything from B. So next one, in this case also S1 is connected to 0. So this is 0, so obviously output is 0. And in this case also both the input selection lines are connected to 0, so obviously this is 0. So if you add these things, finally you will get output one from the OR gate. So what we observed, if A value equal to 1 and selection lines are 0, 0, you are getting output of nothing but A. Similarly, you can apply the remaining values. If you apply 0, 1, automatically you will get B value. If you apply 1, 0, you will get output value C. If you apply 1, 1, you get output value D. So in this way, the multiplexer will work.